at the talks you give, many of us feel or sense something of immeasurable importance. This is not romantic fantasy or illusion. It is more profoundly real than much of the rest of our lives. But after I, have the, I leave, I cannot stop the gradual dissipation of that, of that great profoundness. Sir, this is a true tragedy. What can, we, what can one do? As the talks you gave, at the talks you gave, many of us feel a sense of something immeasurable importance. This is not romantic fantasy or illusion. It is more profoundly real than much of the rest of our lives. But after I leave, I cannot stop the gradual dissipation of that great profoundness. So, this is a true tragedy. What can one do? First, if I may most respectfully ask, Are you being influenced? Are you being stimulated? Are you being driven by the words of the speaker? Or the feeling of the speaker? Of what he says as true as for himself? being influenced by all that. Then if you are influenced, and I hope you are not, if you are, then it becomes a drug. Then you lose it. Then you can't help dissipating that which you have been driven to or influenced or that which has been said or felt if it acts as a drug, then it must disappear quickly or gradually. But if one, this again is being said most humbly, if one actually hears what is being said and discovers for oneself the truth, then one is a light to oneself. That light itself is, can never be put out, can never be extinguished. But if one is dependent on another, However much the other may have something, if it's not part of one's life, one's daily beauty of this, then dissipation is inevitable. And the tragedy is that all of us do listen, uh, sometimes profoundly, sometimes casually. But that very seed is there. But we never give it an opportunity to let it flower. It's, the world is too much with us. And to be conscious of all this, the vastness of the earth, the vastness of the human brain and, and love and all that, is so if one comes to it, not just verbally, romantically or sentimentally, but actually, then that fire can never be put out.